Dow Elliott Wave Analysis, an excerpt from my extensive stock market analysis that was first made available to patrons who support my work. So do consider becoming a patron by supporting my work for just $4 per month, which is peanuts. So Elliott Waves, every high is the 5th of the 5th of the 5th until the market fails to follow through. And so we march on with the next high, then the next high, which is why I take Elliott Wave theory with a mountain of salt. My Elliott Wave pattern of February 2019 has proven remarkably accurate, as did the pattern before that. See, being sceptical works. It's when people think they have found the holy grail, that's when things start going wrong. So always remain sceptical of the tools you use, no matter how good they may turn out to be from time to time. Even the expected ABC of the fifth wave peak in May materialised, but was weaker than expected. So the wave 5 in May was a wave 3 peak, which implies that we, have, we are now in the final wave of a larger move. This suggests not to expect a crash in October, rather just a feeble correction as we have still further to run higher into the end of the year. Wave 1 was 5 months long, wave 2, 2 months, wave 3, 6 months, wave 4 about 1.5 months into mid-June. Currently we stand at plus 3 months into mid-September for wave 5, which means we could be in for another 3 months higher and that October correction will be weak, i.e. we may not trade below 34k. In fact, the Dow may even trade to a new high during October. You know, that's going to surprise many. So conflicts with much of my earlier analysis also suggest to expect the Dow to trade to a new all-time high during late December, early January. How high? It, well, it could go as high as 40k. That's what Elliott Wave suggests. This video is an excerpt from my recent comprehensive analysis of the stock market. A full spectrum analysis that concludes in a detailed trend forecast into the end of 2021 and then continues all the way into 2022 with indications for what to expect even for the remainder of 2022. Analysis that had me dig deep to clear the mists of time. All the way to deep analysis of the seasonal trends on a scale that you will not see anywhere else from the usual seasonal analysis that's expanded on multiple time frames to the sh new short-term seasonal trend and the presidential cycle, best time of year to invest in stocks and a 2022 seasonal investing pattern. And then putting it all together into a final stock market trend forecast and then coverage of AI stocks and my buying plan as well as the high risk stocks portfolio and then we take a look at Afghanistan, China the comprehensive analysis that took me a good well, two weeks to do this analysis and it's first made available to patrons who support my work and do check out my full analysis that's been first made available to patrons who support my work extensive analysis on it updated AI stocks buying levels and more so that you are well prepared for what's to come I thought my patrons are as I am because I put my money where my mouth is what I say what I'm what my analysis suggests I implement it said buy Intel below eight fifty dollars and that's where I did triple my holding of Intel anyway my latest analysis includes AI stocks updated by now as you can see from this list of uh, content and do consider becoming a patron supporting my work for just four dollars per month I'm I'm underselling myself after all this inflation I should inflate the inflation it should be fifty dollars a month not four dollars do remember to subscribe to this YouTube channel for new videos as we chart the inflation mega trend in motion a runaway train and you got the fool that the fed saying what what 
Oh, it's transitory. Oh, there's no real inflation. Oh, it's all now you've lost control. You lost control when you started printing money on ramp. You have lost. They have, you understand this? The Fed does not control inflation. It is, they have lost. It's like the 70s again. They're just gonna keep saying, "Oh, it's trans. Oh, it'll come down. Oh, oh, it'll always oh, come down. Oh, it's oh, oh, oh." They'll do that for a decade. That's what they did. The 70s didn't know it, it was gonna fall the way it did. They just kept saying, "Oh, it's gonna fall next. Oh, it's oh, it's oh, next six months is gonna tear. Oh, it's gonna come down. Oh, it was gonna." Uh, Ten years later. They go, what the hell? We've just spent what's that a decade, right? Let's ramp up interest rates and get kill this inflation monster once and for all. And that's what they did. Yeah, who was it? Greenspan? Was Greenspan this? No, no, it wasn't. It was Volcker, wasn't it? Yeah, that was it. Paul, I'm sure it was Paul Volcker. See, my, I'm getting old. So that's what they did. They, you just we got, we've been talking crap for it. That's what they're doing now. They're talking garbage. Six point two percent. Real inflation's double that. Crazy inflation is it? As I've been warning, you can't say you weren't warned. Go back and watch my videos from eighteen months ago when they first started printing the money. I was saying like, buy your anyway. You're gonna watch it later. So I've got that outro I've got that bit in every one of my videos towards the end so you can watch it after this my strategy during the great crypto bear market of 2021 was to accumulate into select few cryptos that my research had deemed to be well relatively safer obviously with cryptos there's no thing no such thing as safe anyway Deep discounts to the highs of as much as 80% improves the risk reward ratio somewhat. And the rest of this truly extensive analysis has first been made available to patrons who support my work at just four books per month. Extensive analysis that includes cryptos that I have deemed to have a high probability of trading to many multiples of their current price most of which still trade at deep discounts including my price targets or where they, they could reach during the next crypto mania when the millennials will be forming out of their mouths forming so do consider becoming a patron by supporting my work for just four bucks per month four dollars for immediate access to all of my analysis and trend forecasts including learning material and including my recent analysis on why so-called transitory inflation is likely to be permanent so batten down those hatches for what is to come and then there are is my extensive analysis of silver including a trend forecast into mid 2022 also is my extensive analysis on the prospects for the stock market into mid 2022 with my next analysis soon to be published analysis updating the buying levels for ai tech stocks you know google's amazon's facebook's and so on amd tsmc i better stop there for instance intel hit its buying level of 48 dollars last week which is what my patrons have been patiently waiting for since intel was trading high at 65 dollars when i was saying no don't buy at 65 just Buy at the buying level, that's why I've set the buying levels where they are, high probability levels that they should trade down to eventually. And here we are, some X months later, $48, buy. And I did what I said I was going to do, I tripled my holding of this quantum AI tech stock. Now trading at a dirt cheap P multiple of just 9, I compare that to Amazon on what, 58? with many more stocks homing in on their buying levels such as IBM which I bought pre uh, splitting into two well fifth was it five shares of IBM and you get one share of Kendrill if you value them together then the current stock price is around $132 whereas it's trading at 126 so you should have bought before the split you'll have a net value of 132 to 133 dollars against the market price around 126 dollars 
so that's IBM and don't forget Facebook yeah. sell buy and get $384 wait for it wait for it $301 that's what it's homing in on it's not got there yet it came close $308 last week I nearly bought it at $312 but I didn't but it was close so do consider becoming a patron by supporting my work for just four dollars per month for immediate first access to all of my analysis and trend forecasts your mega trends ahead of the curve investing analyst with over 35 years experience that includes being one of the few who both recognized that the stock market was about to crash in october 1987 and profited from it by shorting the Dow before it crashed. Four dollars per month is dirt cheap for what you're going to be getting access to compared to the clowns on YouTube barely out of puberty pumping scams and such like totally oblivious to the megatrends such as the inflation megatrend and the AI megatrend that I've been banging the drums for since 2015 when when you could have picked up the likes of Microsoft for about one tenth its current price then we have the war with China mega trend which I've been drumming since what must be late 2016 yeah something like that all of these mega trends are where the trends manifest themselves and all you're usually aware of is like the fluff on top you know, barely visible fluff on top. That's what most of the commentary is concerned with. You don't even. When did you last hear about the war with China mega trend? I bet you haven't. Oh, the. Well, you heard of AI, but you know it's a mega trend that's going to run for 20 years. And quantum computing mega trend is part of the AI mega trend. Anyway, do consider becoming a patron by supporting my work for just four dollars per month. You're not going to get any better value for money than that. As we defend ourselves, protect ourselves from the rampant money printing inflation by the central banks. Insane money printing as though it's not going to feed through into wage and price inflation. Big inflation is coming as I've been flagging for well, over six months. More, it's more like a year now. That's why I was saying last year, if you're thinking of buying big ticket items, do it now before the price hikes, which have transpired. You know, I bought a Karcher K7 for £340. Current price on Amazon is, was it, £565, and similar for lots of other tech items I bought. For instance, the components in my PC that I ordered in January and got delivered in March was £3,000. 100 pounds current price of the components is over 4,000 pounds crazy the inflation is here and it is accelerating regardless of what the industry say so protect yourselves by investing in assets that are leveraged to inflation and AI tech stocks are leveraged to inflation and are about to get discounted so do subscribe to my youtube channel for such analysis and do consider becoming a patron.